What's going on YouTube? Clayky's all back again with another Final Fantasy Brave XVS update and today we have the mother load of all updates concerning the global anniversary part two. The second global anniversary is here or it'll be here this Friday the 29th and yeah there's a lot of stuff going on. So featured summon second anniversary. Um, at first I was like okay this is gonna be one of those things where you know, it's like, oh, we have upgrades on some of the units like they always do. But nope, it's a step-up banner. And it's type step-up banners, guys, which is insane. And it starts this Friday. Uh, it even has discounts, which is crazy. So the first step-up that you guys can do, as you can see here, only costs 3,000 lapis for an 11 pool. So we'll get into the white, like the banners below, but this is how the step-up works. I don't know how many times you can do it. I don't know if it tells me that. I've been looking. I don't know. We'll see if we can do it like other step ups. It's three times. But the first one, 3,000 lapis. Boom. 11 pull. Pretty good. The second time you do it, there is the rainbow chances are increased to 6%. So the second time, I do believe it's going to cost 5k lapis like normal. But you're going to get a 10% Moogle. And you're going to get 6% uh, rainbow chances on every one of those crystals that come down um, from the 11 pull. Which is insane. And then on step three, which is the only step, there's not step five or anything, four or five, you get a guaranteed five-star unit, which means a guaranteed rainbow comes down, which blows my mind. This step up is a very, very good value. Um, so for each time you run this through, it's going to be what? 13,000 lapis? Yeah, 13,000 lapis, 5,000, 5,000. But I do believe you're probably guaranteed like, I don't know, at least two rainbows maybe if we do the math. Like it, it, you're not guaranteed anything. You're guaranteed the one rainbow. But with the 6% up, that is that is really high. Uh, compared to what we normally have. So, very, very good. So, what kind of banners are we going to expect to have with this amazing step up? Uh, for the first, uh, it looks like for the first week, so this Friday until next Friday, it's going to be attack uh, type. The list of the units included in this pool can be found in the summon drop screen. So, I guess when this comes out, uh, we're going to be, be able to see all the different ones they uh, they say are the attack type creatures or the attack type units. Uh, here you can see Sephiroth, Onion Knight, I'm sure Titus, uh, Orlando, all of them are going to be on it, um, etc, etc. So if you guys are missing out on Chainers, Finishers, things like that, it looks like this is the banner you're going to be able to pull on. And that goes for people who are looking for 7 stars also. Uh, so I'm assuming, uh, we'll look at the bottom, but I'm assuming you can only pull attack type 5 stars from this from this pool. So that's pretty cool. The next one's going to be Magic Backslash Tank Type. So you put Magic and Tank together, um, the list will be in there again, and that'll be, uh, that starts, oh, and actually this is Friday too. They're all open until next week. Are they all open until next week? Poggers, you can pick which one you want to do it on. Wow. I wonder if, as you're doing the step up, if it specifically has to be for a banner. Like, so could I be like, okay, my first 3,000 pull, I went on the attack type. My second one, I went on the magic and tank type. The next one, I went on the support tailor type. There are some uh, things down here below, but we'll look at that in a minute. So this is going to be if you need a magic. It's actually crazy that they put Fravia in this pool. Uh, she does do a lot. Most of the time you build her magic, but she's hybrid. Um, but you will need a magic damage healer, or you still need that tanky big man Wilhelm. He's there for you if you need to pull on this banner. I thought it was going to be weekly. This is just all in one week you guys can do this, which actually is kind of cool because I was wondering if it was going to be like that was going to be the entire um, global uh, anniversary banners. It was just going to be like, you know, one week the attackers, one week them. And then the support and healer type, which is the one that like seems super tasty to me because support and healers... Very strong in this game, and you can see that they have both the CG, uh, CG Lid, CG Nickel, and then Ayaka. CG Fina is probably going to be on that. Um, you're going to have to look on, you know, the drop rate screen when it comes out, I guess. Let's look down here and make sure we see this. Um, let me read all through this. Maximum rarity, stats are derived, the max stats. These units will be added to the EX pool. They're already in there. Uh, select Trust Master rules are not stackable. This banner features three summon pools, and each summon pool only includes units of those specific type. Right, so we thought that. That's pretty good. Only units added to the game prior to the end of June 2018 will be included in the summer pool, summoning pool. So, if they add other units, they won't be in here. So, like, let's say if they they have this banner and they're like, okay, before the end of next week or whatever, or before the uh, before it's not yeah before July 6th, they add some more units. They won't be in there only until the end of June. Uh, five star units obtained uh, from the third step will be any of the already existing five star units for that featured type. Right. So we, that's what we thought. So essentially. This type of banner is really, really, really good. I like it a lot. Um, if you guys, if you guys are in need, again, in need of specific things, you can go there and try your luck. Uh, for thirteen thousand lapis, I don't know. Very good, very good stuff. Uh, what's next? What else do they have for us? Just, uh, just cause three. There's still, uh, we still have to do the whole, uh, you know, fight the bigger trial part, and it's a even more angry helicopter this time. Uh, machine type super effective as we knew. 
Prepare to dispel uh, the shield, Kupo. So we're going to have to wait to get the shield off of him so we can do damage, it looks like. But we're of debuffs, Kupo, so they're going to debuff us pretty hard. I'm not sure how hard this is going to be. 5% uh, Trust Moogle. The Little General. Uh, it's a, it looks like a, uh, a gun here. Attack 81, HP 20%, and Man Eater. That's, that's one hell of a gun. Uh, the attack could have been a little bit higher, but uh, having Man Eater and HP on it, that's a pretty good weapon there. No items gives you some coins, some raid coins. Party of five or less gives you two summon tickets. Defeat him with a limit burst, you get a five-star Moogle. So, um, I don't think this is one you should skip. I think that gun could be very important, uh, for somebody if we end up needing a, uh, you know, a gun wielder or something like that. The guns are actually very rare in the game as far as really good ones are concerned, in my opinion. So, I definitely want to pick that up. We got to beat that boss. Uh, let's go back here look at what else. Cactuar Tunes and the Enchanted Maze are out. Uh, guys, I, I would be farming the raid like crazy for Gil. And for experience, because uh, we're going to need all that when that 7-star comes out. It's, it's very important. Let's go to the notices here. Second anniversary Final Fantasy Brave Exvius. So, this is the campaign. This is the, what we're going to be getting for the second anniversary, all right? Uh, you can see here we have free daily summons starting Friday and going until the second week of July, it looks like, the 12th. Um, free daily summon. Just go go to, you know, you, you guys have been through this before. You go and get the summon. So, that's something we get. The Player's Choice Campaign. This is something I've talked about before in the last video, but it says part one. Uh, vote for your favorite event to become the reality using the player's voice tickets, which you do obtain these by logging into the game. Uh, so I guess you can do multiple votes. Like if you log in every day, you're, you're putting more votes into the pool. Uh, either the Enchanted Maze opens for a month and a Trust Moogles are added as a special reward. Uh, free Daily Summons open for one month. A whole month of Free Daily Summons on top of these. So there's Free Daily Summons here. You can get more uh, with a 5%. Uh, it's a rainbow drop rate. It's not the 6% we had before, but 5% is still pretty high. Cactuar Dunes open for one week, and chance of getting times five times more experience when fusing. Now, it's only that one's only open for a week, but I guess that would be good if you could fuse Cactuars together, uh, get more experience for your seven stars to be able to level up, because they do take a lot of experience. 1,000 Lapis added to the weekly Expedition Rewards for one month, uh, which would be four weeks, would be 4,000 Lapis. Again, guys, I do believe the free daily summon is where it's at, but you guys have the uh, will have the choice on your own. Um, by doing this, uh, and things like that. So you're going to be able to do that. Summon it, summon using the tickets to receive normal pots and metal gant, uh, gigant towards King Snapples and King Snappers, King Snappers, rare, uh, summon tickets or four star guaranteed summon tickets. Okay. So I guess, wait, 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 wait. So, okay. So I guess you, you vote and then you get to summon with them. You get free stuff. That seems insane. Okay. So it's even better than what I thought it was. Uh, second anniversary in game presents. Looks like we're getting the uh, K producer's jacket, K producer's glasses, second anniversary ring, and second anniversary earrings. Just guys, make sure you are logging in to get this stuff. Again, this all seems to depend on logging in every day. I miss some days sometimes, but don't be missing them when this is out. Um, let's see. Second anniversary ticket summon. Get a three star to five star unit plus a four star trust move. Uh, the second anniversary ticket allows a player to receive a unit from three star to five star and a four star trust Moogle, which is five percent. Uh, that starts this uh, this Friday too. Only units added to the game at the end of June are eligible in this giveaway. Uh, so I guess they're just going to be giving us tickets where we get a free five star Moogle and we get whatever uh, whatever kind of unit we're going to be able to get. So that's pretty cool. I mean, you get you get a you get a summon a free summon and then you get a five percent trust Moogle. We're going to be able to get them TMRs at this time, baby. It seems like they're giving us a lot of that. Um, if you complete uh, the main story, players will be rewarded a 50% trust Moogle if they clear the story's second season up to Chapter 3, Part 3. Uh, by, I, get, I don't even know, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September. By September 1st, yeah, I just did that. By September 1st, you guys are going to be able to get that Moogle, get caught up in the story, and you guys are going to have a way to do that. I think they're going to half price story um, for this event, for this time being, so you guys have a chance to catch up. Premium 10 plus 1 summon tickets. Um, <laughs> the, the premium 10 plus 1 summon ticket allows players to summon 4 star and 5 star units when used um, so essentially what this is is uh, summons only 4 star and 5 star units so when you use this premium 10 plus 1 summon ticket you guys will only get yellows or only get rainbows there is no chance at blues you guys are getting a ton of good stuff I, that, this, this, this ticket actually was a, one, one of the more exciting things for me I, I really wanted um, and they always there always seems to be putting the um the whole thing where it says you can only use it, uh, the only units in there are prior to June. So they're, they're, they want to make sure they specify that. Uh, story mission special. This is what I was talking about. Half price of story missions. Um, that's going to run until almost the end of July, it looks like. So you guys will have a whole month to just go through and catch up in story, which is going to be really great for you. This is another big one. You pretty much have a whole month to just go in the trials. It costs half energy to be trying stuff out, trying to beat the trials. 
Um, that's insane. I, 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 that's pretty good. So you guys will be able to go in and try the trials out a little bit more. Try to get those rewards for half the price of energy, which is awesome. Uh, friend point giveaway. Ugh. Friend points, baby. Uh, friend point giveaway. They're giving us friend points. Uh, they're making the standard summon. They're giving us uh, Gil Snapper family and uh, King Metal uh, Mini Tours or King Metal Gigant Tours. We really want those because, again, we need the money in the bank and the experience ready for seven stars, which I'm thinking are going to come in July. So be ready for that. Amazing enhancements, which is really good. Um, the probability, how long does that go to the 12th of July? See, I'm thinking around the 12th of July is when they're going to release seven stars. So I'm thinking that's why that kind of ends there, but we'll see. We'll see. That just gives you the ability to uh, get more uh, experience and stuff, greater success when you're fusing uh, units together. Um, you guys are getting slot expansion limit increases. Equipment slot base limit uh, will be expanded from 100 to 150. Um, so, yeah. So essentially, I think they're just giving us 50 to everything, it looks like. Oh, no, there might be more than that. Ability slot base limit will be expanded from 100 to so get 50 there. The ability expansion slot will be expanded from 450 to 900. Okay, so that's not base. So they're giving us, it looks like equipment slot base limit will be expanded from 100 to 150. So does that mean they're giving us 50 on each of those? Is the base 100 and then they're just giving us 50 more for us to be able to have? Um, that's what it looks like. Yeah, when I say base limit, it looks like they're giving us 50 more. Player rank will be expanded from 200 to 250. Well, I'm about behind about 100, but we can be able to catch up on there. So they're giving us more uh, more ability to rank, uh, not rank up, excuse me, but more ability to expand our slots. And then I think they're giving us 50 in each one is what it looks like when I read that. Uh, returning players campaign. Okay, so this is for people who haven't played in a while, but are getting excited to come back and uh, play FFB again during the anniversary. Returning players campaign. Players who have not logged in for 30 days or more will receive one premium 10 plus one ticket when logging in. So I'm assuming the premium 10 plus one ticket is this bad boy right here, which means you guys can get two of these bad boys if you log in and you haven't been playing for a while. So that's uh, all four stars or five stars on that 10 plus one ticket. Pretty sweet. Um, so you guys are going to be able to get that. Make sure you guys come back and get that if you're thinking, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm taking a break for a while. Just get those tickets. They're insane and use them because that's great value. Um, second anniversary, friend point, trust Moogle summon. Players will have the chance to receive three star trust Moogles, which I do believe are the one percenters. Each time they perform a friend, uh, a, well, I don't know, actually. Each time they perform a friend trust Moogle summon with friend points. So I'm going to be spending all my friend points. I've been saving them up anyway. Um, I do believe these are the 1% because they say obtain three star trust Moogles instead of like, yeah, yeah. Instead of like being dependent on a unit. So I think there's going to be 1%ers, but hey, for friend points, got to eat those up. All chambers are open, guys. You're going to be able to go and do whatever you want with those. And then here's another one. The five star guaranteed 10 plus one. So. We had the premium one that gives us all four stars and uh, five stars possibility to get five stars on that ticket. This one, you are guaranteed a rainbow on it. And the thing is, is it says it, campaign period Thursday, 726 onwards. Which I don't even know what that means. What do you mean onwards? I, I, that allows players to receive it. So does that mean like as long as you log in, you get it, you, you can use it, you can hold it forever? I don't know about that. The Odorwitz part confuses me, but that's right, guys. You're going to get another 10 plus one. I'm going to call it a premium, but they call it five star guaranteed 10 plus one summon. That gives you a rainbow. Guaranteed. There are going to be so many summons. You guys are going to be summoning so much, your fingers are going to fall off. And then finally, they had the special return summon. Um, essentially, they were, the special return summon, I do believe, means they're returning to you. They're giving thanks to you guys. Uh, this is where we got confused and thought it was all lapis spent, and it's always summon lapis spent. So that was uh, my bad for uh, mis misthinking that. I think they, uh, they, I got a little confused, and then they, they kind of didn't, and the YouTube didn't uh, video didn't specify it too well. So it was all com uh, communication error there, and some on my part too. Um, a survey of all players who have spent free and purchased lapis on in-game summons since the release of the application will be conducted. So I guess everybody's going to be taking a survey. I guess they want some feedback on what they can do better in the game. Is what it seems like here. And all the lapis you've ever spent on summons, free or paid will be included in this. So uh, if you spent Lapis on, let's say, refills or spent Lapis on um, other things like that, it's not going to count. It's only summon, guys, so be aware of that. Players will be awarded tickets based on the amount of Lapis they spent for said summons up to this point. So for every 5,000 you spent, you get a special return three-star summon ticket, which I'm assuming is going to have its own like special banner. And then for every 50,000 you spent, you get a guaranteed four-star ticket. Uh, special return tickets will be distributed around the end of July, so we have to wait till the end of July. More details, more details will be announced about this shortly. So I do want to say, guys, I do apologize again. I thought it was all lapis. It is not all lapis. It is only lapis on summons. My bad. Um, but at least you guys do get some stuff back for spending lapis on summons, so that's pretty good. So we get all of that stuff, all of that stuff, and 
They're going to give us three-star espers tomorrow. We get Carbuncle and Golem. Guys, I don't think these will be the most tough esper fights. I don't think they're going to be as hard as, let's say, Shiva. I think Shiva and Ifrit were the uh, most tough we've had so far. <laughs> so, excuse me. Wow, so far. Um, but yeah, you're going to be able to go in here and fight these guys. I'll try to fight him and see what I can do with that. Uh, and then, then in the expeditions, of course, we're going to be able to get the super sites. The story continues. Um, you guys will be able to go farther in the story. I do not know. What does it say? Chapter 3, Part 3. Okay, this is the point you have to complete. You have to complete at least the newest one right here in order to get that 50% trust moogle. So if you've completed up to this point, you will get the 50% trust moogle. Okay, guys? So that's this is the newest story added. And then we have the second login bonuses. Guys, I'm not going to go through all these. You can do it on your own. But essentially, this tells you every day what you get when you log in, right? It goes through a bunch of days, up to day 20. Um, a lot of them seems like it's the player's voice tickets. Um, it seems like there's a part two uh, to that as well. See, you remember there's a part one, a part two. Um, and it talks about everything else when you're going to be able to get all the goodies. So, that pretty much concludes everything we can get from that. Holy moly. And uh, I, I, that's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of good stuff. I'll do my free daily summon right here while I'm talking about it. Um, it that is actually insane to me. We are getting so much good stuff, and I do believe we may still have yet stuff to come. Um, we have the big 3.0 update, as we talked about from E3, where they're going to be giving us all kinds of, um, you know, in-game in, in changes, such as being able to uh, fuse more uh, up to 99 units at one time, to fuse uh, Gigantoirs, to fuse, uh, you know, stat pods. Um, the reload button is going to be insane. There's all kinds of more stuff to come, but that was just all the, a bunch of goodies you guys are going to be getting, and it starts this Friday. So we got to be excited about that. We got to be ready. We get new story. We get two new experts to fight, and we get that new trial for uh, Just Cause. On top of the fact that we got our boy Shadow, on top of the fact that, uh, you know, we we get those step up banners, which I was not expecting at all. We, we literally get step up banners, and they're actually really good step up banners. The discounted lapis shows. It makes me really excited because will they do that in the future? I don't know. So before I get off here, I got to do something too. Let me just lay these to the side here. I'm going to be giving away two of these bad boys to um, my YouTube uh, base here. Two of these bad boys. Just because uh, Final Fantasy Brave Exvius uh, posters. We're giving away two of those because, you know, I got to do, do some giveaways too. I can do some giveaways. I can't let uh, Gumi and Square Enix take over. I gotta do some, so we're gonna give away two of those, and we're gonna be giving away a one hundred dollar gift card to either iOS, a Google Play, um, or Amazon Coin. And you guys are gonna be able to find a link in the description below to enter. Again, it's the same thing we've always done on my channel, where you uh, follow me on Twitter if you follow, me, subscribe to me on YouTube if you follow me on Twitch if you sub to me on uh, Twitch, and I have Instagram on there now. All those social medias are gonna give you extra entries into this raffle giveaway. And again, two of these doesn't matter where you live. I'll, I'll end up getting it to you as long as it doesn't cost me like a million dollars. You know, I'll be able to give two of these bad boys away to you guys, and then I'm gonna do. Uh, uh, so I'm gonna draw, and it's gonna be for a poster. I'm gonna draw, and it's gonna be for a poster. Then I'm gonna draw, and it's gonna be for the hundred dollar gift card. All right, guys, and that is gonna be given away at the middle of July. I'm going to wait till about the mid-July. I'm going to give you guys about 14 days to be able to get in there and do that. Um, Shadow's loving it. I'm loving it. The second anniversary is going to be big. So thank you guys so much. And get ready for some cool stuff. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below what you're most excited for. And uh, subscribe for future content. Don't forget to enter the giveaway. It'll be in the description below. See you guys later.